Published 1749 Eastern Daylight Saving Time, the 9th of April 2018. Updated 1833 Eastern Daylight Saving Time, the 9th of April 2018. A Brazilian sports reporter who was forcibly kissed on TV while trying to do her job has sparked a movement of journalists standing up against UAL harassment. Bruna Deltri. 31, a reporter for the channel Esporte Intruditivo, was reporting live from a celebration after a soccer game on Tuesday when a shirtless man in the crowd landed a kiss on her lips as she was speaking to the camera. The journalist reacted in the moment by shrieking in shock, but quickly regained her composure, saying to the camera, that wasn't cool. I didn't really need that, but it happened. Scroll down for video shocking moment. The moment Esporte Intruditivo reporter Bruna Deltri, 31, was forcibly kissed on camera has inspired a movement of journalists speaking out against harassment. That wasn't cool. A clip from the broadcast, which sees Bruna shriek after the kiss before continuing her report, has been viewed more than 1.5 million times. That night, Bruna decided to address the incident, writing a post on Facebook and sharing the excerpt from her report. The video has since been viewed more than 1.5 million times. I've always been a reporter who loves to celebrate with the fans. I don't get bothered by people soaking me in beer, jumping around me or stepping on my foot, she wrote, but today, I experienced firsthand the impotence so many women feel in the stadium, on the subway, even walking in the street. I was kissed on the lips, without my permission, while I was doing my job. I didn't know how to react and couldn't understand how someone could think they have the right to act that way. She added that it was clear by the man's behavior that her job and the work she had put into doing it meant nothing to him. Taking her stand, after the incident, Bruna took to Facebook to talk about what happened, saying, I deserve to be respected joining in. Bruna's peers were inspired by her experience to come together and produce a video spreading the message of with the certainty that head, held, high we will win the respect we deserve and that the citizen who wanted to appear as who should be ashamed of what he did, she concluded with, I'm a, soccer, reporter, I woman, and I deserve to be respected, her words garnered an immediate response, particularly from her female peers in the industry, 52 of whom joined together in a WhatsApp group after bonding over Bruna's post. Ting hints from the they produced a powerful one-minute video featuring a number of the reporters and some examples of on-camera harassment, including Bruna's shared experience. The clip also included a number of other instances of on-air harassment banding together. Bruna, pictured left with two of her Esports Intrudivo colleagues, hopes that the buzz around the movement will fight against the normalization of harassment. Each journalist then shared it to social media accompanied by the hashtag. The video has since been shared by thousands of people, and even helped prompt Brazil's sports ministry and the National Secretariat for Women's Policies to launch their own campaign featuring female athletes speaking about their own experiences with harassment in the industry. Speaking to CNN, Bruna expressed appreciation for her fellow reporters and hopes that the video and the movement will help fight against such harassment being normalized. I think my experience caused an impact because it happened live, on camera and in the context of soccer, she said. I'm hoping this example will leave an impact and make men think twice before doing something like that again.